What is up guys? Today we're making this paleo sushi, so let's get to it. So we're gonna start by cutting up our bell peppers and then we're going to cut up our cucumbers and I like to take out the middle part just so that it doesn't get soggy and then just cut those into little strips. And then after we cut up our cucumber, we're going to make our spicy mayo. So just put sriracha and mayo in a bowl and we're gonna mix that together because we're gonna put our tuna in there later. I did too much, so literally do half of this amount. And then we're going to take our avocado and you're going <clears> to <throat> skin it and then slice it. And then we're going to cut our tuna steak into bite-sized pieces. And after you cut those up, you're going to throw them in that mayo mixture and just mix it all together. Now we're going to take our bamboo sheet and we're going to put our cauliflower rice on there and stick it on there. But leave the top part empty because that's where we're going to kind of adhere our uh, nori together. And then we're going to put in our spicy tuna, our crab, our avocado, and our cucumber in there. And then you're just going to wet down the part that you left empty of the nori sheet. And we're going to take our bamboo roll and we're going to roll it around. Once you roll it around, you kind of want to like squeeze down and push back a little bit. And then we're going to wet down the piece of nori that we see again and then roll the rest of it over on top of that and then that's going to give us this sushi roll and then we're going to wet our knife and we're just going to go back and forth until you can slice through and then that is it and these sushi rolls were so freaking good um i didn't show i made other like philadelphia ones for my fiance that had the bell pepper and then i put shrimp and the crab and cream cheese and he absolutely loved it these guys were amazing if you guys try it out let me know like rate subscribe and bone apple tea y'all